Marvel fans are psyched for this green superhero, but not the one you're thinking of. We just started a superhuman law division, and I want you to be the face of it. The Marvel Cinematic Universe is filled with unique characters. There are gods, wizards, super spies, ninjas, and robots running around all over the place, causing all sorts of trouble. Now, with the multiverse in play, the possibilities for weird and wild individuals to pop up are exponentially larger. The multiverse is a concept about which we know frighteningly little. The multiverse is real. But we don't think true believers were expecting to see the latest green-clad addition to the Marvel Cinematic Universe in the first footage for She-Hulk, Attorney at Law. And we're not talking about Tatiana Maslany's Jade Giantess, either. With super strength, a winning personality, and a law degree, she's pretty much better than you in every way. At the 123 mark in the trailer for the upcoming Disney Plus series, we see what looks like a green and yellow Power Ranger in a fighting stance. The scene cuts away so quickly that you almost miss it, but eagle-eyed viewers can make out this character's uncanny resemblance to a frog. Even for longtime Marvel fans, this is an extremely deep cut, but it can only mean one thing. We're about to meet the MCU's Frogman. And no, we're not talking about Frog Thor. <laughs> Created in 1982 by J.M. DeMatteis and Carrie Gamble for Marvel Team-Up No. 121, Frogman, a.k.a. Eugene Patilio, is the son of the supervillain Leapfrog. After his father's failed life of crime landed him in prison, Eugene started wearing the suit in an attempt to rehabilitate his family image into a symbol of good instead of evil. However, Frogman wasn't exactly the most adept hero. On his first outing, he accidentally helped Spider-Man and the Human Torch defeat Speed Demon. Later, he would battle the likes of White Rabbit, Flag Smasher, and Ultimatum, alongside his dad in the Avengers, and would again triumph thanks to sheer luck. Of course, that luck would fluctuate. Some days he would be teaming with heroes like Ms. Marvel, Iron Man, and Hellcat, but on others, he'd be targeted by Kraven the Hunter, or forced to work as a busboy when superheroics weren't panning out for him. All in all, the fabulous Frogman seems like the perfect character to join the cast, especially since She-Hulk is primed to be a comedy. Yes! 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 No! No! Comedy seems to be the key word here, since a more dramatic Marvel show probably wouldn't find the time and space for a character as niche and strange as Frogman. However, the She-Hulk comics provide the perfect template for this. In the best of them, she's an Avenger by night, but a lawyer practicing superhuman law by day, working on cases involving superheroes and supervillains. And while an A-lister will occasionally slip into the courtroom, Jennifer's bread and butter involves her rubbing shoulders with the odd corners of the Marvel Universe, fighting for and against the heroes and villains who don't have the cash or reputations to sidestep the long arm of the law. This is a legal practice! It is not the place for morality! Enter Frogman. Uh, we assume. As the title itself implies, She-Hulk, Attorney at Law, is a legal comedy set in the MCU, with Jennifer trying to balance the demands of being a lawyer while also, you know, being a Hulk. While other heroes need to worry about saving the world, Jennifer Walters needs to worry about getting her clients reduced sentences and whatnot. We're deep enough into the Marvel Cinematic Universe that this kind of self-aware comedy feels necessary. A superhero universe can only get so big before the weirdos in costumes start to spill in the margins of polite society. With his history of bumbling his way across adventures, the idea that Frogman ends up in a courtroom for a crime he may or may not have committed and needs to call upon one of the MCU's superhuman lawyers makes total sense. In fact, what's the point of making a She-Hulk TV series if she's not constantly dealing with a parade of bizarre characters who have no business appearing in a proper Avengers movie? If we're lucky, Frogman is the tip of the iceberg, and this show will be chock full of C-list Marvel characters awaiting their day in court. While we don't know who is playing Frogman just yet, we'll find out when the show premieres on Disney Plus on August 17th, 2022. Check out one of our newest videos right here. Plus, even more Slash Film videos about the MCU are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.